It's so good. <gasps> and I was in so much pain. It was my tummy. Price. Nothing else. I use this because of the price. Is this not the fridge of my dreams? It's like dollar. Hello, good morning. It is Monday morning. I am getting ready to leave the house because today I'm doing my first show. It is 7.30 a.m. Waiting for the Buddha guy to come through. <sighs> doing my first radio show this week. This week's vlog is literally how is this going to go? Are we going to mess this up? To make matters worse, this guy's decided that we won't be working from the office for the rest of the week. So we're doing today's show in the studio at the office and then wednesday thursday friday we're doing it on site like in in the fields on a location somewhere so <sighs> wish me luck ah, oh do you want to see my look let me show you my look <laughs> so i'm wearing my mini pants this colorful palazzo pants <laughs> i have this top it's uh wanted it has like a mesh at the back and the front but then i did like a knot at the front so that we have a little skin why not i just got here and in good time the sun is still doing the thing jagero's show is still going on so i'm listening to that I'm about to go up and prep for my show but i'm so excited for my first show <laughs> i um i had started planning for the show this morning but i want to like do the finer details and actually put together a proper script and also there's some work from my calendar that I want to take care of before, well, for this part of Don't them. give it another shot. We've had enough, I think it's time to stop. I fucked up everything we ever made. Some people change, but you know I won't. I want to style my hair. I want to share like different styles that can be done with this hair this entire week. Okay, let's see how the headphones will sit. I'm psyching, I'm psyching myself up, I'm like just listening to music. <laughs> so I want to come. Oh, I can even come with me in Malaysia. Okay. Oh. Uh, no, no, my camera, my bag. Um, we see how it's gonna go. <laughs> you can also find us on Twitter at Power Radio, that is at P A W A Radio. You can tweet at us, hashtag She Talks on Power Radio. Shout out to Chris, who's listening to us from Nairobi. So, are we saying that misogyny has infiltrated that far deep, even that? A doctor is willing to put the life of a child at risk because when you think about it the question the question i keep going back to is did you shove that girl aside and say no 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 not you yet guess who bought it their first show i did i did that was so fun that was so cool excitos excitos sana to every person who tuned in thank you so i'm now heading to tau and i can head uh home because today i also have a podcast recording session so hakuna kulala leo hakuna there's no for kirea for sleeping <laughs> it's so hot oh my god it is so freaking hot i'm trying to figure out the best way to um, have my work blocks still work for me while I'm doing this because especially this week we are working uh, Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. The other times it's going to be Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So I'm trying to figure out the bestest ways to get the most out of each day so that I don't end up because there's those days where when you come to Nairobi you end up wasting the whole entire day. There's nothing else you can do. I don't want to have that be the case. I want to be able to. I want to be able to still get my other work in there so so far the leaving the house early and doing my first work vlog from the office legit we're keeping that for sure oh my god it's so hot the trees are ending here the trees are ending here and i have to walk in the sun at least my skin looks good in the sun <laughs> my skin looks good in the sun so i have to be home 
by latest 3.30 because the last work block or rather I think maybe the other option is on the specific days when I'm doing the show the three days I'm doing the show I can have an extra work block at night so I can add one extra work block even if it's just two hours uh, maybe from when I finish down at 6.30 maybe I can be doing like another block between 8 p.m and 10 p.m. or even 9.30 but we'll see how it goes okay what trying to try my oh well i just got home and it is literally a couple of minutes to 5 p.m it's about 10 minutes to 5 p.m so two things um kids are going back we're going back to school today so living cbd was heck freaking take it was so hectic trying to leave the cbd it has taken a lot longer for me to get home than it normally would and then by the time i got into kikuyu town which i don't remember what time it was but i remember texting my boy it was around four ish um so i went i went to the market i picked up a couple of vegetables uh no fruits actually i just took veggies and then i forgot one thing <laughs> which is what we're making for dinner nyama so i was supposed to pick up some veggies and nyama and then I bought everything but forgot the nyama. Guess what I remember to buy? Ice. Why? Because I want to make iced tea because it's so freaking hot. I feel so exhausted. I do not see myself filming um, for the podcast today. But I'm thinking what I can do is I can get some writing going. I can't wait to buy a new fridge because yo, I miss having a fridge. My other fridge had to sell it because circumstances and shit. But I've already found a potential new fridge. I still actually regret selling the other fridge because I haven't even found something as good. And, you know, in pricing, also because things have gone up, I actually do regret selling it. But it's okay. Like, some with some of those things, like, at that moment, that was the best decision for me. At that moment. Um, looking back, I did, I possibly had some other options. I just didn't have enough time to explore because, you know, things were moving too fast. So yeah, I miss that. I left my makeup here because this is where I did my makeup in the morning. So I'll put this away. We'll prepare some iced tea. We're going to sit down and enjoy the iced tea. I'm going to go pick up some omesh for the cats. And then we're going to come back and make dinner. Today I am, ooh, do you want to make dinner with me? We might as well film um, another type of video, right? Where like me being tired doesn't change the fact that I'm going to cook. So... We are making, oh yes, now I'm excited to film with you because I am making the most scrumptious <laughs> beef, um, beef stew. I guess we can do that together, right? Okay, cool. Yeah, you know, I'm excited that we'll do that together. And yeah. And I guess that that's probably going to be like a completely different uh, nini because this video is going to be very jam packed, but I will share that as a separate video, as a recipe video on its own um, so that I can give as much detail as possible. Also, um, let me know, would you be interested in recipe videos? Because I was thinking, I don't mind sharing like a recipe a week because I enjoy cooking. I cook a lot. I think I have pretty decent recipes. And for me, cooking is like literally like another DIY project. So maybe like you can let me know in the comment section if this is something that you're interested in. If you'd be interested in like maybe once a week, I give you a recipe video. But I think I'm just fine. Oh, I forgot. So, I have some peach iced tea that I already bought. I have it. I didn't make this myself. Um, I didn't know I was I was coming home to make iced tea. So, I had just bought this because I just wanted to try it. It's by Aqua Mist. It's peach in flavor so that's what we're going to use for this and we are going to also ooh, i'm curious let's play around we're going to play around with it i have some carbonated soda this is in rose because i was going to just use um club soda but i think i want to use this instead we have carbonated soda this one is the rose it's called hola 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 i have some mint so i'll start with my mint and we have mango, so because it's like mango season, I want to throw in some mango in there. Because it's a really, I want it to be very tasty. So we'll make like a pulpy thing. So let me put that. So we have, so I've not put too much. That's the mango. We have some, we have some uh, mint. Let me add more mango. Okay. 
Uh, I'll get a muddler because I have one, which is for making cocktails. Did I tell you guys I'm actually considering um, leaving alcohol behind? I'm going to just muddle this up. The mango and the mint. I don't know if this is like sugared. If not, like we might have to add some sweetener. Oh, it's already sweet. It's okay. It's already sweet. We're just adding, we're layering flavors, honey. That's what we're doing. I feel like... Ooh, I can taste the mango and the mint. Then we put the ice. So, we're going to fill it up with ice. Then that's enough ice. We'll pour in our iced tea. Ooh, it's already looking so cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. Is there anything I don't say I love? I love everything. This is just for a kick. I think let's first let's mix that in a bit. Good. I love it. I love the way it looks. Okay, we'll put that there and then we'll just top it off with some of this. <laughs> ah, now let's taste it. Oh no, first let's take photos of it. <laughs> okay. Ah, there we go. Oh, let's throw in some. Let's garnish. <laughs> okay, taste test time. Let's see. Come collect me. <laughs> it's so good. Listen, this is why I need a fridge because I want to be having this every single freaking day when I'm walking outside and the sun comes up. Because you see, when it rains, what do I always drink? Uji. When it's hot, 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 what do I always eat? Ice pops. But I need something else. <sighs> Iced tea is about to be my new identity. And it looks so pretty. Ah, oh my lord. Yes. They are trying so hard to find the weaknesses inside, but it's gonna spill. Oh, can we take a minute turning face? The critics let's put flowers in our hair like we don't care. And wavua uko nyuma. How is the food? Me have not enjoyed it. Yeah, thanks. It's so cool. It's only. Yay! I served you like two seconds ago. Ah yeah. And then to take this down, we are having a mango and um, mango pineapple smoothie. So remember, I had asked if you would be interested in me sharing my recipes once a week. I don't mind. I can find a way to make things happen do let me know good morning i am here to do my makeup i am late i am late by my standards because this is the time i should actually be leaving the house it is 7 57 naturally this is around the time i exit yeah, i'm on my way to kikuyu town but 
I've had such a terrible um, and I was in so much pain um so I went to the loo as you naturally do so I went um and yo it was dramatic in there then I went back to bed and from that moment like I was still experiencing the pain it's been like that the whole night I, I've been just going to the loo I don't know if it's something I ate because yesterday yesterday I was actually such a good girl I didn't kula kula you know like I am um, because when I leave the house I I can easily snack on random random things and changanya different things everywhere all the time I didn't kula kula jana like that Yesterday, actually, everything I ate, I ate from the house. I didn't eat anything when I was outside. Um, I had, in the morning, I had some mandazis, which I had bought from, from Clean Shelf, and we had that with um, with tea. I came back, I had lunch. My lunch was the food I had cooked the night before, which was the, the peas and the, um, the peas and, uh, well, the, the beef stew and rice, right? That's what I had for... That's what I had for lunch. The food was okay. Um, and then I had cake because cake was the only thing. I had bought cake when I went to Kikui town. Ginger, I need to see myself in the mirror, please. Just sit down. Thank you. After I, and I had the cake af at night after I, like, it was the last thing I had before I went to bed. Um, and that was it. I didn't eat anything else, did I? No, because I ate like a really tiny piece of pineapple when I was making uh, my mint. Because yesterday I made pineapple tea and I also made my pineapple, I made a pineapple mint juice. So I don't know where the tummy thingy came from, honestly. I don't know. I don't get it and I don't know and I really don't appreciate it because yo, it really just, oh, oopsie, it really messed up my night. Because I really had trouble sleeping. Like, hey, my night was long. When I tell you my night was long, I'm not even joking. So now I'm doing my makeup real quick. It's just... Ooh, it's a nice gloss. I have to wipe this down before I put it back in the... Oh, I love it. I love the way it looks. <laughs> so I've gotten off on the highway because it's easier to cross over to that side from over here but it's so freaking dry in Nairobi uh, it looks like it might rain and I'm wearing my gum boots because it was raining in Kikuyu <laughs> my pants are wet uh, there's a bunch of boda boda Off. This is what the fuck? What's this energy? And I need to cross this highway to get to the other side. Ah, my god, annoying. I need to cross over to that side of the road. And these Buddhas are like bullying. So I need to find like a, a safe spot for the crossing because I'm close to where I'm going. If one more Buddha dares to hoot at me, I'll throw this umbrella at them. It's so annoying. So we are here. Um, this is not our... There's like different stages. So this is like the main stage where performances will happen. Where performances are happening. I guess opening ceremony is already underway. Uh, yeah. So that's like the main stage. And then there's like... Um, there's something called Street Hekima, Hekima village. There's a political village. There's the youth village, which is what we're a part of. And then there's the, I forgot the other ones, the SDG one. Yeah, Kina Jagera have already started. So that's good to know that his show is already underway and I've been listening in. So I can tell like the quality is still pretty decent. Um, I haven't seen the setup, I've seen some photos, but I, st I hope it doesn't rain on this side because, yeah, that would ruin a lot of stuff. I 
I finished my show. Yeah, I'm going to look for something to eat. And so that's the youth tent. But people have really been dancing and having fun over there. But the place is like really full. There's like students and and everything in between. So. Let's see. Okay, there's like a huge queue. Like I'm looking for food. So I am heading home. I have work to do and all. So I have left. It's like 2 p.m. Oh crap! It's like 2:30. So on a rush, I'll do my last work block. Well, my second work, third work block, because the radio is a work block in itself. Well, actually, technically, my second work block because I didn't do any. Another walk block in the morning before doing this. Am I feeling better? Yes, my tummy no longer hurts. And um, see you tomorrow. Yeah. All right. So I am heading home. And it looks like it's going to rain. It hasn't rained yet here. But it definitely looks like it's about to start raining. And I definitely, definitely do not want to be caught up in the rain. That's for sure. I feel tired, but it doesn't matter because I have to go home and actually get work done either way. Whether I'm tired or not, I still have to go work. So I just got back home. I wanted to show you something. Do you remember two days ago, and I have to say this so loudly, two days ago when I made an iced tea and I put my ice cubes, the leftover ice cubes in the thermos. And guess what? Guess who still got ice cubes? This girl. This girl. Whatever. So when I put my when I put my ice cubes in this, they were they filled up the thing, right? Right now they're like halfway. But mind you, it's been 48 hours. Yesterday when I checked, after 24 hours, they were like sort of three quarters. So some of them had melted. I was like, I wasn't even sure I was going to find ice cubes today. I was certain. I was almost a hundred percent certain that I was only going to find cold water. I thought it was just going to be cold water. It was not going to be ice cubes, but eh, I was so wrong. I have to pour out the water first, but I know the water is like nice and cold. So I'll put it in the tumbler. So we have nice cold drinking water. Also, I'm going to text them and ask them if this, if this can keep things cold as well. Like, I might just test it myself. Actually, I should leave. Let me leave like, let me leave the, okay, let me put the water. So I know that's, that the water must be cold because you still have. Also, let me just show you in case you think I am joking you. I am not. Are those not ice cubes? The other ones that were left in the paper, we ended up making a smoothie with them. I'm not going to make a base the way we did with the mango and thingy. We'll just actually pour the tea. So this tea I made yesterday. This is cinnamon and pineapple tea. <laughs> Let me put this ones here. We test, we test the, we test the tumbler as well. Because um, in the morning I, I was wondering, oh, if I carried my iced tea in the tumbler, would it still be cold? Because initially I intended to make iced tea. So I'll just pour that in here. Okay, and then I'm going to top it off. Oh, okay, should have need more, but it's okay. It's still, it's very, very tasty. FYI, it actually has no sugar. I did not put any sweetener, no honey, no sugar, nothing. I'm going to still top it off with the rose because I feel like the blend will be, the blend will be very nice. Uh, let me just. Ooh, how pretty. Ah, it's so cute. It's so cute. It's so cute. Let me take a photo of it before it ninis. Before it whatever. We don't have garnish. Guess what we do have? We have lime. Oh, lime. But because if I had some, if I had some ninis, it would have been really cool. If I had some pineapple, some leftover pineapple, that's what I'd have used. There we go. Mm. Oh, the rose, the rose soda makes it really cool. But I want to do something else because extra. Um, 
orange flavored blue curacao. So, let me see if it's gonna work. Yes, it's going. I want it to go to the base, so I'm using the spoon to direct it to the base. I'm gonna mix it all together. I've, I've not put too much, I've just done a little. There we go. Then I remove my spoon. So now, Jojo, what are you doing? So now my blue curacao has gone to the base, so now I have like a gradient effect. Gosh, I'm so extra. I was just supposed to make. Kidogo iced tea. I want to add more of the pink. That's why I'm drinking, drinking. <laughs> there we go. Let's add a bit more tea. Just Kidogo. And then we add more of the pink, of the rose soda. There we go. Now, now that's the look. Let me get my phone. I am about to become an iced tea addict because is that even possible? Ah, she's so pretty, Jojo. Do you want to be in the background of my? Oh my lord, she is so gorgeous. Mimi, in life, I can't. I'll never stop DIYing. <laughs> like it's so pretty and it tastes so good and it has like a gradient. Mmm. I am Kakai Chun in Fanya Kazi. Nikki Troma na Jua. But do I care? No. Why? Because I have the most gorgeous, gorgeous iced tea in hand. <laughs> I'm gorgeous and tasty. Mmm. 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 Oh, I love it. I love it. Have I told you just how amazing the iced tea is? Because, yo, I feel like, I feel like I'm not saying it enough. Good morning. It is a sunny morning today. We thank the heavens for that. And today is Thursday. Yay! Almost done with the week. Almost done with the week. Today I decided to wear a proper t-shirt in case anything happens or something like what happened yesterday happens again. I will not be over there being like, I really don't like the way they need because this was supposed to be a completely different thing. I don't want none of that. I am um, doing my makeup. Oof. I'm doing my makeup to head out. I finally found my Nivea um, SPF and I found it at Anivas in Westlands because yesterday I was like, hey, after, like, you know, the way my son has been burning, I was just like, where? Apana, we just, I can't, I can't survive like this because it was what was like just two days because the other times, like, this is after I have already cut out the thing in half and everything. Why this particular one? Price. Nothing else. I use this because of the price. Because it's unfortunate that sunscreen is something that we have to wear every day. According to science, multiple times a day. But they sell them in such tiny containers and for a lot of money. It just, why? I like this one. One, as you can tell, there's no grey cast. I like that about it. And it's a, it has an act, it actually has a mattifying effect, but you don't feel like your skin doesn't feel ashy. You don't feel like that white cast, you know, anytime I would go into any shop, it was anywhere between 1100 and 1150. Yes. Yeah. Yeast. Yesterday I bought this for 1300 at Naiva. So I don't know if it's a Naiva's Naiva sing thing or if it has gone up to 1300 shillings, but for the price, I would most definitely recommend it works. There's times where I do nothing else to my face other than just to wear my sunscreen. Because if you do nothing else, wash your face and wear sunscreen, you're good. Just wash your face and wear your sunscreen. And that is already like really good because you're taking care of your skin. Today I was thinking of going to look at fridges because I've been thinking about a fridge a lot. Uh, I have to send a, I hope this finds you well type email this morning. And it's, uh, it's people who've been like delaying with my payment. And I was like, I just said, I'm going to bite the bullet. The moment that payment comes in, I'm just buying a fridge. I am just going to buy a fridge because you're, it's annoying. Then the food I'm throwing out, because I am, 
I'm trying, I'm really trying to also just cook smaller meals. But even then, I'm still not using everything. Like, I feel like almost every single time I cook, a portion of my food, a portion of my food is getting thrown out. And I don't like that. I don't like, I don't like throwing out food. Yo, I have lived a life where I have gone to bed hungry on multiple occasions. And the pain of throwing out food, me, I know it will. Like, I feel it. I, it's not something I want to participate in because I know what it means to sleep without. You know, I really, I have, eh, me, I've lived a full life, Bana. I know what it feels like to, to go without. So it pains me a lot when I'm throwing out food and to a point where, like, my guilt makes me, like, skip a couple of meals other times where i'm just like where well, i'll just bite the bullet but now i need this food to actually send me my money because that money has taken forever um i need them to send me my money and then i'll just bite the bullet get me a fridge so now i was thinking this afternoon what i can do is after after the show I can go start looking at fridges because I have an idea of the fridge that I want. It still needs to be a bottom freezer um, because those are the bestest. After having a bottom freezer fridge, I would never go back to a top freezer fridge. Trust me. It is a game changer. You get a lot more space. And I can finally start, I can, I can go back to stocking my nini, my ice pops, you know. So, yeah, that's where I'm at right now when it comes to that. That's, that's how I'm feeling. Time to do my hair. Well, time to style my hair. There was a UDA Because it's true. So I am so exhausted. I ended up staying the whole day. I am now just going to take a a Buddha. I'm going to Wisty. So I've come looking at fridges and, and then I just walked into this one and I'm like, is this not the fridge of my dreams? It's like glass. It's glass and then it has like a black nini and it's by Vaughn and I've used Vaughn before and I liked it. So like because the fridge I had before was a Vaughn. I'm like, okay, not like for right now, but like this is like the fridge of my dreams. Just the, the glass bits, honestly. The, also, I look so cute, but also the glass bit is like everything. And then I was looking at bottom freezers, like fridges with bottom freezers. So there's this ones, they're pretty tall because I need it to be, it needs to be a bit on the shorter side because this one's like they're giving family and other things. I have seen one here that I liked. Um, so now I can start planning for this one. I think this is the one I want. It's LG. I think this time around I'd want to buy LG. So this is the one that they have. Um, I'm at hot point FYI. So that's the bottom freezer. Three compartments. And it actually has an ice tray. The other one I had didn't have an ice tray. Um, that's the second freezer. Oh, and it has things for, for hands if we had not noticed. And then the lower one then up here uh, that's what it looks like it only has one box the other one used to have two which is not a big deal because it's like one big box the other one had like two small ones and they've also petitioned like the for the big thing is for you over here so huge huge contender and what I like is like this one instead of having things on the door like your, for your think no, it just has a smart inverter, less noise, voltage stabilization, and right now this one's going for 121k, like 122,000. Um, oh, they have black fridges too. Oh, this is an interesting one. This one is Beko, and it's, I think it's a bottom freezer, and it's 80k. Oh, and they're okay. It's actually smaller. This one. What's the height? Uh, Okay, so this one is by Beko. It's a different brand. Yeah, this one is giving single person, but it has like a lot of tapered, a tapered feel, and I don't know why. 
and it also has the setting thingies on the inside this one's a clear i like that as well. the other one was white right oh it even has a freezer oh, it has a manual freezer controller but it has a it's a bottom freezer and this one is 80 g's um let me see it's actually 81,000. i don't know why it's not 80 okay i'm trying to see the height uh, okay I, i'll keep looking i also want to go look at some cookers and then see hello happy international women's day today is international women's day and also today is my last show at the festival because i don't have a saturday show it's been a hectic week i woke up with a headache today but today's show is going to be light and easy because today i'm basically um interviewing different women doing different things or different amazing things wherever they're from uh i have a lady from kajado uh another one from kisumu some girlies from madari because today is international women's day so i'm dedicating well my show is always about women but i'm dedicating the show to have women amplify the things that they're doing so i'm doing my makeup i'm finishing up on my makeup basically so today i am wearing blood sweat and female the white version and some shorts i've been getting back here extremely exhausted and by the time i get home it's like 5 p.m so yesterday i stayed i stayed there until 5 p.m although i was working i wasn't working on my stuff i was still working like for the radio so in terms of my schedule my routines I for sure need to come up with a plan. I just got to you when I'm looking very cute. I wanted to wear different shorts. So these are the shorts I'm wearing. I wanted to wear my black shorts. And then <laughs> I was like, well, do I trust uh, people not to harass me? The answer to that question was absolutely not. So I ended up just changing into slightly longer shorts. Yeah, so today Fena is performing, but I also don't know which stage. So I didn't even know there's like performances like that until Jana I bumped into someone who was like, oh yeah, but I'm, I'm, I was performing today. So yeah, it's been like that. But I don't know if it's like the youth village that's not like, you know, hopping as much with performances and stuff, or if it's just other villages have more money, you know, like politicians and their political parties, you know. Let's see how today goes. So let's see how it goes. We are live. <laughs> Listen. Yeah, and we can clown around when it's just 